everybody is getting involved with Prime Link, and I'm going to show you one of the features they use with the archive and link section. I'm going to show you how to use it right now. But guys, hit the link down below to get started with Prime Link right now if you haven't. Follow along this video. Let's get into it. So guys, once you've logged into Prime Link, it's going to look a bit like this on the dashboard, all right? We're going to be concentrating on the archived link section today. So everybody follow me down to there. Now, if you don't know how to use this, what it does, first of all, is we'll come up with the links that you have archived. In the link management, you'll see a bit that says links. So to actually archive a link, let's do that first. You want to go to links, choose the link of your choice and hit these dots. You're going to go down to archive, okay? This is now going to add this in. If you go back to archive links, to your archive section, see how we now have free. So in this three section, you now have your archive links. There's lots of things we can do. Okay, so guys, at the top, we got select all. If you want to automatically select all of them, you can deselect as you need. Unarchive selected. Okay, you can add to the campaign. So if you want to add a certain amount to a campaign, you can simply add that. Choose the campaign of your choice and add it in. You can add to a channel. So again, if you want to add one of them, for example, to a channel, you can do that. Add the channel. We've got DSG and add it in. Guys, if you want to use the pixel side you can add pixels to it as well of course just add the pixels in like that and you can delete so let's just delete one okay so that's deleted now guys this is your results so if you have ultimate links so for example if we go to links here okay and we select all and we archive Okay, we go into archive links. You'll see now we have a lot of links in the archive section. Now, this is how you can sort through them. So you can sort here by the oldest. You could put 100 per page, older than from this date, for example, and filter it on. Okay, and it'll show you them exact links. Now, export and archive links. All you gotta do is hit this export button on the right. This tool actually allows you to generate a list in the CSV format. Simply click this, so maybe select all of them, export the list, and they'll be exported, guys. They go into your downloads, okay? If I open this up now, you can actually see all the links I have on here, guys, all right? Super, super cool like that. So that's how you play with your archive links, guys, all right? What I want you to do is note that if you want to be able to use all the features on this, you need to get one of the packages. And with them packages, you can start for free Free right now but you don't get all the features the $59 will get you a limited features but $99 one time fee is going to get you the unlimited features of everything that we have here guys the link down below is going to get you an extra discount as well so please please use that link down below and hit get started there you go guys hit the link down below to get involved right now follow this channel I'm going to be showing you how to use all the features with Prime Link have fun hit the like button hit the subscribe button and the bell if you want to be notified and I'll see you next time